fan. Stop it! Why? Oh, please go further away. Greetings, travelers of the Spultered Mesh, and welcome back to Grand Rapids Minecraft. I'm Nixira, and I'm so glad to have you guys here today. So just kick back, relax, and make yourselves comfy. Because we got some mines to dig. Actually, that's not true. So what I've been doing uh, in between recording is actually doing uh, pretty much just that. I, although I haven't actually gone after any mines, any actual mines, I might do that. But I have done a lot of mining, and I have a ton of resources now. It get the diamonds and the emeralds and all the irons and the golds and uh, redstone, lots of redstone colors. And it's not like I did a whole bunch of things, but I did do one or two things. Okay, the one thing I did that didn't really get me resources except cobblestone and dirt and granite and uh, andesite is I dug out all of this. Also, I got a llama. Hello, llama. It doesn't have a name yet because I don't have a name tag. I am open to suggestions. But I'm thinking... <coughs> I actually don't have any ideas. I dug out that. And I dug out a bunch of this, Ooh, I, and it, it kind of goes around. I'm still working on digging this part out. Also, this, it's got, yeah, it, it's just a lot. I, I still have a long way to go, but uh, carving out the inside of the mountain is coming along. I haven't decided entirely on decorative style, and I still want to know what to do for the outside the outside. Eh. Oh, hi. Please don't attack me. You gonna be civil? Cool. We cool. Alright, so. Shut up. So, as you can see, all of this mountain, it needs some structure added to it. Gonna make it awesome. I need to work on a style of build, and I need silk touch for the frig skellings! Ow. No! God dang it! Spider! Spider, I thought we were cool! Right. So I guess it's becoming nighttime now. Can't do that. Anyway, yeah, I want to add some, you know, building onto the freaking mountain so I can truly be the the mountain king S. Okay, so the style of decor that I'm looking for is going to be I, I mean I tried a whole bunch of things for interior design. Got like this, this, this. This, and this, and this is kind of cool, actually. I might use this in some room. Maybe. Um, but ultimately what I decide to go with is more Mountain King style build. And so, um, this is kind of what I'm looking for for interiors. You can see there is, um, a bunch of chiseled stone and cobblestone gates, or cobblestone fences. Uh, pretty much just because uh, they don't have non-cobblestone ones. <laughs> they only come in cobblestone or wood. Um, we got the dark oak here, and we got andesite as the floor because I just think it looks it's really super cool. I mean, why would I want to use cobblestone when there's this pretty andesite? Look at that. 
Um, and on the outside, I was thinking maybe something kind of like this. I'm still not sure about that one. So any any suggestions on that would be pretty cool. What is this? Oh yeah, I was experimenting with uh, fish tanks. Uh, so yeah, I just I want to do it looking like this at least on the inside. But please give me suggestions for what the outside should look like because I really need help with that. But as you can see, I definitely need things like uh, stone bricks or just stone in general, dark oak, and then there's a dead coral. The other thing that I did, um, besides digging around down here, I, I dug a bunch of stairways down to the low levels because I was gonna, you know, try to find diamonds, which I didn't find any really on my mining quests, but... But if we go down this insane stairway, which is going to take for freaking ever, watch how long this is. If I can keep being interesting during this, that would be impressive, because it's a very long stairway. Very, very long stairway. Just keeps going. Going all the way down to block 8. All the way down. From the mountain, mind you. So it's, <laughs> it's quite a lot. How oh, is it? High elevation. I was on a cliff. Oh wait, hang on, this needs light. Bam. Okay. Oh my word, it's so long! Jeez. It's even longer than I, I remembered. Why is it- Okay, here we go, we finally made it! Finally made it down to the bottom, and there's this long passageway, which is the first passage that I made. It's, um, but it takes even longer, because what we're gonna do, I have no food with me. Good. We got plenty of meat, right? Okay, so, down, not down that tunnel, that's the long way. But, I mean, what I've been doing lately has been digging this insanely long tunnel and and digging this slightly less insanely long tunnel which goes about to here and then it keeps going that way because I initially went that way and, and made it longer. I shortened it, kept doing what I could to shorten it. And we're gonna run down here. And we're gonna ignore that tunnel because that's the even longer tunnel. But, what we got down here is just an incredibly, incredibly long tunnel that took me two days to carve out. And you can see that I'm passing like tons and tons of resources. I didn't carve out mostly because I was trying to make my pickaxe last longer. But I should probably do. Uh, you can see there are places where I keep passing obsidian. Uh, it, because I had to, I wanted the tunnel to just be straightforward. I didn't want it to curve around anything or jump over everything. And there were lots of lava pits. Lots of lava pits. So I got a bucket of water and I just I had to clear it out. There are also some places where it's all cobblestone. And because before I decided to get intelligent and <laughs> grab a bucket, I, um... I, I was just putting cobblestone gradually in place where the lava was to, to... What was that? What the f... Why do I keep... That was weird. What am I running over? Is there something here? No? What the heck? Hmm, weird. Anyway, so I, um, dang, there's a lot of resources here. Carving out all of this was just, I just kept coming across resources and resources and diamonds, so many diamonds. I kept hitting the jackpot on that. It was amazing. Also, I'm already this low on food. Here we go. Because I'm running so far. Eh. So yeah, I am now 
doing pretty well for myself. I, only because of this tunnel that I dug out. Like, I haven't done anything else. I haven't gone, you know, dungeon crawling or anything like that. I just... <laughs> uh, yeah. There's still, I, there's still so much gold around here. I really need to come down here with more cobblestone and just carve out all the resources and fill in the holes. Or I could just leave a bunch of holes open like that. You know, uh, someday I'll reach the end. It's such a long tunnel. Ha! Uh, well, did you see that? It looked like we were coming to the end of something, but nope. Joke's on me. Oh, we've finally come to the end. Uh, unless I've gone backwards. Oh, no. No, I haven't gone backwards, because I didn't go through... Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, I just had the same thing going on, that's all. Oh, I forgot to put the cobblestone stairs in. I'll do that later. Now, you may, may be asking me, why did you have to dig so freaking deep just to do a tunnel? Well, that is because the, um, the tunnel that I was building had to go under, um, under the ocean. Under the ocean, so that I could come out here. It's a coral reef! You know how long this took me to find? That was the other thing that I, I've been doing uh, outside of recording, was just looking for this biome. It was so incredibly hard to find it. Like... <sighs> no, like, the, the mods that I was talking to yesterday, I was showing my place to, they, when I show them this area, they were like, oh, I've never seen one of these before <laughs> on the server. <laughs> because they're so scarce. There's, I, I'm not sure there are more than one. Like, it's just one really big one here that goes all around here. And this was the only one I was able to find. So, I mean, and, and I'm gonna build, um, a big fancy castle place here for my base. Did I just break this? I think I just broke this. But I'm I'm going to need um, to do that out of coral because I don't want to have it. I don't want it to have co cobblestone. I want it to be bright and colorful and corally. But for that I'm going to need a silk touch pick because you, cause when you mine these guys um hang on, I gotta go up for So when you mine these guys, um, without silk touch, you just get dead coral. Which is good for me, because as you saw, I need that for particularly the, the dead brain coral, which is this pink one, for my, um, castle interior, for my base. So that's cool. But I would also like to have the colorful ones for other stuff and I would really like to make a shop for selling um, corals and fish and stuff. Which is also why I brought buckets. Whew, that's hard. I want to make a coral farm and I'm all out of bone meal though so I'm gonna have to go skelly hunting. But that's fine. That'll, that'll come with time. Now, I do have a Helm of Respiration 3, which, uh, a leather one, which I, I happened to find in a shipwreck, I think? So that's worked out for me, because uh, before that I just kept drowning repeatedly <laughs> while I was looking for this stuff. It's still difficult, though. It's still difficult. I'm trying to be kind of scattered with my mining of this because I don't want to 
you know, get rid of all of it. It's okay that these fans are disappearing and stuff because I'm just gonna use bone meal most of the time anyway to bring it back. So it's, it's okay. It's not nothing to worry about. I hear a drowned. If there's a drowned with the Nautilus, that would be pretty sweet. Not gonna lie. I need those for my conduit so I cannot drown. Stop doing that, dude. I wish they were andesite steps or steps that were not cobblestone. What kind of steps are there? Oh, there are brick ones, right? No, wait. Is that a thing? If so, I will use those instead because I think I'll like them better. Okay, so I really need to light up this place more so I'm not getting all these monsters. You should not be spawning here. What the frell is this? It's daytime! Go away! Ow. Do do do. Just need some levels. Oh crap, gold doesn't give you levels. Oh no. What am I doing? I'm breaking everything. Oh my gosh. Okay. No, this is fine. This is fine. I'll just put this back. Right there. Yep. Nobody sees, nobody knows. Infernal skeleton. Level 7. I will fight it. Only if I do that, I will die. Did you guys know? I didn't know. This server is on hard mode. I'm never gonna survive. I'm glad you guys really enjoyed my whole uh, failing angle. Failing at games angle that I have. Um, because uh, that is exactly what I'm going to be doing as per freaking usual. Wait. It's, um, hmm. We have too many things. <gasps> That's where my territory is. Oh, and up there. Is that the middle? Or the corner is this this can't be the middle the middle has got to be over I need a lot more blocks okay where's my window oh my word there's all this space in here so as you might have guessed filling in all the holes with cobblestone does not make it look very proper mountain like it's clearly it's clearly been tampered with and that's no good we don't like that so i'm putting cobblestone in here temporarily what my goal is to be able to to get out full stone blocks and for that i think i need silk touch i also need stone for this well, uh, as you can see, I've got some stone steps in here and some little chiseled stone things there. But I, uh, I, I, I mined those off of some temples and stuff. I didn't, I, I didn't actually, um, make those. And I'm gonna need a lot more and I'm not gonna be able to just go find all the freaking temples to do that. I need, I need more, I need stone steps around here, like the the examples showed and up there at the top probably gonna want to make it go up 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 so that it um has a, a nice layered ceiling going higher i think that'd be really really cool in order to get silk touch i need to have an enchantment table which i was able to make due to my crazy long tunnel that i made to the ocean which is you know that's great and all but uh it's not high enough level apparently i need to have 15 bookshelves around this thing 
in order for it to be able to get a high enough level that I can that I can use that enchantment. So what I need to do is get a lot of leather. Leather is how we case the books. And therefore, in order to have enough books, we need to have a lot of leather. I have none at the moment, so... Guys, you gotta grow up faster. Faster, I say. They're also really good for rations. I also need paper, and for that I have sugar cane, which I built this little farm here for. There's a bunch of water under here in between these areas, and I've just put a carpet over the top because then you can walk on it and not fall in and all the sugar cane won't fall in there and they can just pick it up really easily. I don't have anything more fancy than this. I know there are redstone farms for it, but I, I, I don't have all that stuff yet and I don't know how much I desire it. I probably will later, but at the moment it's not a priority. I have so many bricks now. You know what's the best part about having this many bricks? The fact that it only took me 20 minutes of swimming around in rivers to get it all. <laughs> I'm gonna be filthy stinking rich. Now there's a reason I need this many. I mean, the marketplace uh, uses this for currency. These, um, th these weird points that are marked with the steering wheel shape. Or maybe it's not a steering wheel. It looks like a steering wheel to me. Anyway, and as well as a shop itself costs about 2,000 of these, so I'm going to need a lot. Balance. Still got 500 to go. That's okay, because I have enough stacks. If I have a stack of 50, that would be 500, and I have... You know, the three stacks of 64, so I'm good. Now, I'm going to hold off on using those points to get a shop until I get Silk Touch, because, as I said before, I want to be uh, selling various corals and stuff, and for that I'm going to need the Silk Touch. I wonder how you get the little fan corals and stuff, uh, the like, little plant ones that float around. I tried several ways of picking them up, and it didn't work at all. So, I'm going to have to find that out. I, I might ask... <coughs> Ooh, who would know that? Probably just the internet, because, yeah, the, the mods here apparently don't have a whole lot of experience with the, the uh, coral reef, because it's so unusual. What is this? Excuse you. Thanks. I have a lot of redstone. I should do something with it. Hmm. Okay, so I've hollowed out this space behind the wall here. Ooh. Yeah, just behind this wall. I think I'll do something with... What was that? Oh, it was an Enderman! No! I don't have water in here yet! Crap! Gonna have to get on that. What was I saying a second ago? I don't even remember. I was terrified into oblivion. Oh yeah, wait, I remember. Yeah, I was gonna, uh, I'll do something with redstone back there. I'm just not sure quite how I'm gonna do that yet. I'm not picking up any loot here. Wait, there's an infernal cr that. No, he's not sparking. Where is that guy? If I go fight him, I'll probably die, but let's do it anyway. Eh, get out of my way. And cows? Where is this guy? Oh, there you are. You and your friends. What? Boom! Shoot! What the actual heck, man? You shoot fire? Why do these skeletons keep vanishing? Was he on fire? Why is he running away? Oh, 
Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Ah! What the freaking frick one? Oh no. Not cool. Not cool. Not cool at all. Not cool. Not cool. Did it die? Is he still alive? What happened just now? I am really confused. I'm just gonna put some torches up here. I'm really sick of these guys spawning down here. I don't think these torches are actually doing anything. Is that what hard mode is? The torches don't keep away enemies? Because there are like tons of them everywhere. Oh, I guess I'm not seeing any over here. There they all are. See if we can kill some. Hi guys! Any takers? I appreciate that you're coming at the same time instead of from like two different sides. Oh good. Uh, for a second I thought it was just gonna explode. Also I did not enchant these things. I got these in a vote crate. For voting. Thanks. Hmm. It's getting dark. No, I must not shy away this time. This time I'm going to adventure. Because we don't lose levels here. Whoa. And this server, for some reason. Not that I can really complain about it. Where is you? Where is you? Where art thou? Oh, growling zombie, there you are. Ah, you were trying to hide from me. Oh, there's more of you. I really hope that the creeper does not spawn behind me. That would suck. Ow! Frick! Oh no, you guys are becoming many. Nope. Not cool with this. Give me your levels. Yep. I appreciate it. Okay, sheep, mushrooms. Wait, this is starting to feel familiar. Aha! I'm unstoppable. Oh. Except by that, that's border. That's the edge of the world. I can't get through there. Ow! There were more of you again. Come on. Be patient. Ah! What the frig are you? You are big. Oh, you're, maybe you're not that big. You just have really mixed up armor. Why are you holding more zombie? Man, you guys don't give up, do you? Ooh, you dropped something. But it's just gold armor. I have plenty of gold. Okay, well I guess I can't go any further that way. 
I have well and truly discovered the edges of the earth. What is this? It's a potato. Wah! Hi. Hi there, friend. Ow. Okay. That's fine. I see how it is. Hey, a spider, come and get me. You don't swim, as far as I know. I don't think... You don't swim, right? Oh, crap, they swim. <laughs> this is exactly what I needed. Where'd he go? from another angle. Um. Crap. My shield's broke. My shield broke! Oh, there's another guy with an arrow, isn't there? That's what was happening. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Please don't. Aha! I win. I'm the best at not dying. That is a lie. Okay. I'm doing all right here. Yeah. This isn't the worst thing ever. Right? I don't have a shield anymore. We're just gonna definitely pose a problem. Ow. Like that kind of problem? It's much harder to deal with the mobs in, in, in mass when you don't have a shield to freaking hold them off. Yes! Also, he dropped iron. But I have no room for it. I don't feel like dropping gunpowder. I feel like that could end up being a mistake. Oh, it's dark. I better run. Well, I can make it to daytime. Oh my word. So, okay. I don't have a shield, so I can't deflect this. But, if I be you, then I'm the best. Yes. Oh, ha ha. Oh, come on. Okay, well, so much for that. <gasps> I have enough. Of course, I don't think I have enough levels. I need even... Oh, come on. Do we have different ones? No? Oh, come on. I have to have 30 levels? 30? Uh, I'm not doing that right now. But that means that next time we might very well have Silk Touch. Or we'll get some. You guys can join me. I'll go fight more things and level up to level 30 and it'll be great. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a thumbs up or a comment down below. I'd love to hear from you. I hope to see you again next time. Until then, have a good one.